<laughs> oh look! Hello. Now the two learners drive normally in the meantime. <laughs> Oh, I hate this. Breathe in, breathe in. And then turn right fully. No, because he wants to turn right probably. Oh. Why is he sliding? Why is that oh. on? Because she put it on to move off. Oh. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Clearview Driving. My name is Salmon and today I'm doing another driving lesson with Erin. It has been some time. What's it been, like a month now? Yeah. <laughs> we always have long breaks between our lessons. Um, but yeah, we've got um, a mock test for today's lesson. But kind of a casual mock test. It's not a very strict mock test, so you can still talk, any questions, whatever, ask away. But yeah, drive independently. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I am going to get you to follow the sat-nav. Is it okay there, or do you want me to move it up higher? No, it's fine. Yeah, okay. okay. I'll turn that on um, a bit further down the road. But instructions as normal. Yeah? All right, for those of you that are new to watching the channel, don't forget to like the video, comment down below, and subscribe if you're new. And we're going to go straight into this. So when you're ready, Erin, let's get started. Oh, look, another learner. <laughs> We've been playing a game saying, uh, <laughs> spot the learner. Told her she'll be here all day at this rate. Now the two learners drive normally in the meantime. <laughs> <laughs> I told you I got all too you're gonna excited keep seeing. By the another one. Oh, look at behind it. It's another one again. <laughs> oh, that is just so crazy. But I told you it's like <laughs> looking at airplanes in an airport. <laughs> Oh my god, it's just going. So no feedback throughout, yeah? yeah? I'm giving you instructions and then get you to follow the stat nav later on. But this will be the first road that you move out onto when oh, you start your test. Great. Yeah. At the roundabout turn left, please. It's the first exit. In this right turn, Erin should have been positioned close to the centre line and she also looks away from the road ahead too early. As the road is on a bend, it's very important to keep looking ahead and right before committing to the right turn. I actually know what I was going to do then, I was going to get it down, I don't know. The road that we're currently driving on is not wide enough for two vehicles to pass through the middle and Erin was initially positioned in the centre of the road, but as soon as she sees the learner approaching she starts to go too close to the left and getting a clearance fault from the van on the left hand side. We should have stayed in the middle until we get close to the learner car and then move round through that space but slow down instead to make it easier. Just putting the AC on, it's really hot.
change gears a bit earlier, you need to check your mirrors more because I'm not seeing you checking them, okay? And excuse the AC smell, that's going to go away <laughs> after it's been on for a little while, okay? Yeah. If you could pull in and park up on the left somewhere safe, please. Is in front of the bus stop somewhere too? In one of these bays will be fine. Like right in the one right Yeah. In front. It's a safe place, isn't it? Yes. Not too close, not too close, not too close. This car is bigger than the other one. That'll be fine now. I might be a bit overcautious with that one. No, 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 that's good. That's fine. Oh, yeah. All right, okay, so what we're going to do now is I'm going to get you to follow the sat nav. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Any questions you're not sure, anything you're not sure about as you're driving, just ask away. Okay. I'm still an answering your questions, okay? Yeah. to move off. Oh. <laughs> ah, I forgot I did that. <laughs> so we're turning right from here. Yeah. So right here. Let's see. Turn right, B361. As we turned into this new road, Erin should have waited on the left hand side before this red car. As you can see the road ahead is very busy so going any further than this can get us into a lot of trouble and that's exactly what went on to happen. Are these people in the queue as well? Mm, no. I'd wait. I'm so confused. Just looks a bit messy now. Alright, now the bus clearly can't get past you, so he's gonna wait there. Or he's gonna squeeze past you. Oh, oh Mr. Bus! Come on, move over to a little bit to me. What to you? Yeah, yeah. Clutch control it, okay? That's it, and just stop there. Alright, now take your time. Can you get through from the back on the right side? Can you see it? <gasps> it's getting through, right? Yeah. Oh, I hate this. Breathe in, breathe in. <laughs> and then turn right fully. All the way. You've got to steer it fully though, yeah? Yeah. Because you know you're in a tight spot already. Turn the wheel all the way. Okay. You okay there? Yeah. You want to have a chat about that? So when we came out of that T-junction, we should have tried to be more left okay. and then kind of seen what was happening before we move forward. Yeah. So looking at the sat now for this uh, little bit oh. here. Oh my god, I don't know where it's It's a straight it's line. Okay. Yes, you following that blue line? Okay. After 200 yards, Look at the blue line. turn left, A350, then It was squiggly, then it was squiggly because right. the road was squiggly. Why is he looking over his shoulder? Because I'm too close. <laughs> no, because he wants to turn right probably. Oh. Uh, why is he sighting like that? <laughs> He's got a bag in front of him. Oh. Uh. Turn left, then turn right. Can we overtake him? Not right now. Lots of space, look. There's a bendy road. 
but there's lots of space. It's, it's a wide two lane, yeah? Just stay in your lane and keep well away from him. Keep more to the right if you can. All the way. All the way. And just stay there. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Now you can see what you're doing next on the sat-nav? Yeah, going straight. After 200 yards, turn right. What lane are you in there in? Yeah, come on, get fully into it then. You're partially crossing that centre line there when I said that. Okay. Check your right side mirror, you need Turn to move right. closer to the right if you can. Oh, yeah. That's better. There's a zebra crossing right there. Now before we continue from here, I want you to look at the sat nav. What are we doing next? Erin? What's the sat nav saying? Go straight. And then? Go right. Yeah. So we're on a one way road and we're turning right. Yeah. So we need to go. Down. Yeah. <laughs> at the end of the road, turn right, oh, 8306. You did, I saw you turn. Yeah. Just put your signal Turn on. Turn right. So now the sat nav. Is that go straight? Go straight, yeah. So there's no turn for a while, is that? Now, how far is your turn currently? Yeah. You can see at the very top. <laughs> how far is the turn? Just there. Oh. <laughs> Three and a quarter of a mile. Three quarters of a mile, okay. So that means until we've done that three quarters of a mile, we're just going straight the whole time. Yeah. And that number's going to keep dropping down as we go further along this road, okay? Yeah. Now, Aaron, can you park up on the right-hand side of the road? Um, just in that space there, I'll be fine. Just check the right side and go fully behind that car. Go on, fully in line with that car. Okay, what I want you to do is I want you to reverse and close the gap on your right because we're too far away. So reverse back about two car lengths, okay? Erin, before reversing. Oh, yeah. Thank you. And even during the reverse. Just back up a tiny bit more and then we'll leave it there, okay? Stop there. Thank you. Secure the car. Switch off the engine for a minute. Have a little break. How's it going? Okay. Okay. I wanted to just talk about um, the, the few junctions we've done so far and kind of the bits we could have improved on. Um, but before we get into this, now earlier today you mentioned something which you've never mentioned before um, and it makes a lot of sense. <laughs> so today, of all days, Erin um, mentions that she's dyspraxic yeah and yeah. that's when um, it definitely makes sense it's to do with um, when, when you struggle with coordination yeah. and what's the other one coordination uh, spatial awareness, spatial awareness so spatial awareness and coordination and obviously that makes a lot of sense now this is the first time she's mentioned it to me but yeah that definitely would have made life easier <laughs> had you mentioned that earlier but yeah um, remember we've always talked about clearance and yeah. when you move from one car to the other that that space changes so when yeah. as soon as you get back in this car that left side unfortunately is a little bit too yeah. close at times so <laughs> when we were driving earlier I want to talk about the mirrors yeah. you know you should be checking them yeah. when you're making these left and right turns you're forgetting them. I know I'm so forgetful but it's okay we're gonna just need to figure out a way of getting you to check your mirrors yeah 
So what I can do is I can put a little tab here, a little sticking out thing, and you'll be like, what on earth is that for? So that'll remind you to check your mirrors. Yeah. Yeah. Um, just write M on there if that helps. And um, that will definitely get you checking mirrors more. You remember that right turn where you were focusing on the lady on the right hand side? Yeah. Pedestrian. Yeah. When we were approaching that, your attention was solely on her, that I didn't feel like you were actually looking round towards the road on the left. Yeah. There was a motorbike approaching. Oh. Like we had enough time before him, yeah. but I felt like your focus was 100% on the turn and the lady. Yeah. And that's when you said, oh, I wanted to go down a gear there. Do you remember? Oh, yes. That one. Oh, yes. Yeah? Yeah. So you've got to make sure you focus on the road you're on as well as the road. So it's like 50-50 attention yeah. rather than 100%. Yeah, because yeah? we haven't come off this road yet. Now, we did have a clearance fault with one of the vans parked on the left side. Um, you remember that bus situation? Yeah. Okay, how could we have handled that better? So we kind of got into a bit of a pickle there. Go in a different way. <laughs> no, seriously. So when you were coming out of that T-junction and yeah. you said, oh, I hate doing these junctions. Yeah. But you did the junction nicely, didn't you? Yeah. As you went into the new road, you kind of followed the cars in front, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now let's take it should back I a step. Should I just have just gone on the right and kept going? No. Oh. <laughs> you should have gone on the left and mm. waited before the messy section. Oh, okay. And then looked ahead and gone, actually, can I get through? Because you kind of went next to a car, didn't you? Yeah. And then the bus was now trying to squeeze past you. Yeah. I know that bus turned up later and he could have made life easier by just waiting, but yeah. London buses, they won't do that. Yeah. Um, we should have anticipated, actually, that's not my side of the road. Let me make sure it's spacious, like where, well, I want my go. Let me make sure there's enough space for me before I go forward. Yeah. yeah? Um, the sat nav does the whole three quarter of a mile and all that makes sense. Yeah, no. Yeah? Yeah. Where's it gone? I, I took it off when, oh. when you were reversing. The reverse here was nice, but you gotta look. Yeah. So we gotta <laughs> get some of these little things in position for you to start doing this. Let me get that in place first. What about talking out loud? Do you think that will help you? Yeah. Like not me talking out loud, yeah. you. Yeah. Kind of reminding yourself that way. You're thinking, all right, I'm turning in however long. Yeah. I'm gonna check my mirrors. I'm gonna signal. So that right there is a reminder for you to check your mirrors. Okay. So whenever you see that, what does that mean? Mirrors. Mirrors. Check what's behind, and especially when you're turning, check what's in that direction. Yeah. Okay. Can I put the sat nav back on and we go yeah. again? All right. When you're ready. We'll make a left in here. It's on, isn't it? The car, yeah, it is. Checking. Thank you. So just do a left in here. Turn around when possible. Oh, be careful of the pavement. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, well, well, okay, survived. Ah, no! Wait, just wait there, just wait there. Go on, she's waiting there. Go on then. I can't get past Yeah, you can. you can. You can fit into there and then she can get uh, past you. Yes. Take your time with it. Checking your that's it. Taking your time with it. She said wait there and she did and you just sat there. Yeah, because I thought she was going to move out of the way. <laughs> when people give way, After they don't go yards, like completely out the way. Yeah. They do exactly just enough. Six. Yeah. So that they, you, know, you can both fit. Oh Turn left. All right, Erin, I want you to make sure consciously you're leaving more space on the left yeah. and you're checking whenever you're moving your position. Maybe, how about, tell me what colour the car is behind you. Just kind of mention, oh, blue car, yellow car. It is blue and yellow and white. <laughs> Police car. <laughs> our next turn we are going round around about round around right. about right okay so without the sat nav having said anything you already know all of this just by looking yeah. at the diagram yeah that way you're prepared yeah <gasps> that man looks terrifying 
don't know which one, there was too many at the time. It was, a, it was covered in tattoos. Oh, okay. <laughs> Not the one on the bike. Oh, I didn't see him. So speed on this road is? 20. Mm, 20? You're 20? I saw, <laughs> I saw 20 something back there. It changed to 30 just when you said um, the man with the tattoos. 20. If you turn in there. Uh, How are you meant to know when things change and there's no signs? Well, 30, remember, doesn't have signs but street lamps. Oh, and 20 always After has signs. After 200 yards, go right on the roundabout kind. and take the second exit, B363. Know what you're doing? Right on the roundabout and take the second Hello, exit. Thinking about our chat. Oh my god, I was in no, second no, no, gear. it's not a big deal. So it's a left turn from here, okay? You know how to pick Go up in second. Go left on the roundabout and take the first exit. Good, take then it wider, take Aaron. the second right. Wider. That's it. Now where are we going? Uh, to the right. Okay. Turn right, A4. Now we are in the overtaking lane, which is not a problem. <laughs> Not saying anything. Should I have kept going? It's one of those ones where it was like, <laughs> yeah, I don't want to say anything. Traffic lights just hate me. They just want me to, um, until the last second. They, they want you to that. stop at green and go yeah. at red. I yeah. get it. We've had loads of issues with lights, I know. But yeah, approaching that light, just step off the accelerator. There comes yeah. a point where, you know, you have to go. Yeah. With that one, I didn't want to say anything. No one was behind, we stopped, it's all good. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. All right, so what happens if we make this turn from the overtaking position? We have to go into the far lane. <laughs> yeah, far lane, but not this side. Yeah. On that side, but far lane, yeah. The right one. Yeah. Yeah. So you see the island right there? Yeah. We still go across the island, Yeah. but we take the inner lane. Yeah. Whereas he's going to take the outer, the outer one. one, yeah. So whereabouts are you thinking of changing gears? When we get onto the road. Oh, on this or straight on bit, this straight bit yeah. but not on the turn, okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We've got enough time on the straight bit. Not after the roundabout incident. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, nicely done. Brilliant. Now what is the speed limit here? It's 40, yeah. All right, let's aim for 40 and then we want to get out of this lane as well. Move over that way, boy. Yeah, check your mirror. You've got some space over there still. All right, now let's After tell everyone we want to move back. Turn right. Yeah, checking. We're good? Yeah. You can see him. He's not speeding up, yeah. is he? Yeah, we can come in. Now just turn that off. Look at the sat-nav. What we're doing next. such an ancient thing, like why don't people just use Google Maps? What's because, that man's ancient? Yeah, I don't know anyone who owns a sat nav. <laughs> Me? Yeah, because you know. you're a driving instructor. <laughs> if you weren't, then you definitely wouldn't. Yeah, I know what you mean. Alright, now looking at this road, I need you to slow down. What is the speed? Chat again. 
just behind would have done, you know? <laughs> just that interior mirror. There you go. Don't need to move your head, I can tell when you're checking it. <laughs> Alright, if you could pull in and park up on the left behind this silver car. In that space. Can you see the space? There's two spaces. Yeah. Go in the second one. Good. A bit more break. A bit more break. So that we don't leave it till we get there. Nicely done. Stop there. I'm gonna try and stop. So that we're actually in the way. That'll be right there. Secure the car. Okay. Take a deep breath. I'm gonna turn this off. Otherwise it's gonna keep talking. All right, we'll leave it there for today. How are you feeling about today's drive? It wasn't terrible, it wasn't amazing. It's been a while since our last lesson yeah. again. We need to, uh, like going forward, we need to be a bit more regular with these because yeah. test is coming up. Yeah. Test is coming up, guys. Um, on the, on the, the 30 roads, you're fine. But then, yeah, when we go onto a 40 road, it takes you a bit of time to just transition, get yeah. to 40. And then when we go from a 40 road back into a 20 road, it takes you a bit of time. Mm -hmm. But now that bit of time is where you're going to make a mistake because you're yeah. now going too fast for the road condition. Mm -hmm. yeah? yeah? So I need you to realise speed limits a bit more. I'm done. Oh, sorry. So what we could do is, I personally... Okay, but you get distracted, don't you? Yeah. So I was, I was going to say, I would say it out loud, like, you, you know, as you're driving, just talk out loud, but don't let these little distractions, you're like, oh, the man with the tattoos, and the, that's not important. But what's <laughs> on the road is important. I can't help it. So you know when you said the man with the tattoos? Yeah. At that exact same point, we had a 30 sign saying the yeah, speed is yeah. now changing, but you didn't see the sign, you no. saw the man. So I need you to try yeah. and keep your eyes on the road, <laughs> okay? Yeah. But yeah, so we could do like a talk through where you're mentioning what's important for the road and how it's going to affect you yeah so noticing the 20s noticing the speed changes noticing that oh there's a hazard on my side or there's a, a, a an obstruction that i need to wait for because that's ultimately what happened with the bus wasn't yeah. it yeah we just went too far and then you're like wait what yeah yeah all right guys that's the end of today's lesson hopefully you have found that to be useful but we are going to be a bit more intense with these lessons going forward because test is coming up as you guys know yeah and we need to take this seriously because yeah. we're going to get it in the first one, <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> it's not an issue if you don't, so no pressure. <laughs> but um, yeah. yeah. All right, guys, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.